Hi, I'm Tinny from Mini Bowl Design, and today I'm uh, out in the factory working on a batch of uh, M6 Voodoo's. Now, I've been thinking about <laughs> this whole process and came to realize that I spend almost my entire day out here in this factory building product uh, alone. There's nobody else. Nobody comes in here when I'm building. This is an enclosed environment. Uh, I go in at around uh, 11 o'clock and spend 20 minutes eating dinner, and Sue gets to see me then. And in the late evening, I make sure that I watch the national and local news with Sue and Beth uh, sitting on the couch. That's about an hour they see me there. Uh, then I go upstairs and do my email and go to bed. So. Uh, every day, Sue and Beth see me less than two hours every day, and the rest of the time I'm I'm by myself. <laughs> Odd, huh? <laughs> That's just the way it works. Uh, now today I got an order that made me start thinking. I got an order for $119, and the order was uh, from Slovenia. I don't even know where Slovenia is. I think it's somewhere in Russia. Uh, but uh, yesterday uh, the order was to Denmark, and today it was Slovenia. Uh, I literally ship all over the world, and I have no idea what people do with these stoves. Uh, you know, some of them are just deck packers, and they just want them to play with. Uh, on a workbench somewhere, just for pure enjoyment. Some people uh, actually are hardcore backpackers and use them for backpacking. Uh, some of them are Boy Scouts. Could be anything. Um, it's really a very diverse group of people that uh, uses my stoves. Now I counted back from the beginning when I first started selling stoves on eBay about 10 years ago, and over the 10 year period, as near as I can tell, and I can't get it right down, to, but I've got a, a, a rough number, that the number of customers that I have had buy from me in that 10 years uh, is about 7,000. A lot of those haven't bought from me for 9 years, they're gone, but you know, in the process of 10 years, I've, I have accumulated about 7,000 customers. Uh, <laughs> that's bizarre. I looked at my YouTube uh, stats the other day. Well, somebody emailed me and said, have you looked at your subscribers, the number of subscribers you have for your YouTube channel? And it was 6666. 6,666 uh, subscribers. And the number of views is... Uh, I, it's either coming up on 6 million or over 6 million, I can't remember. And the number of videos is uh, well over 1,600 videos. It's amazing. Uh, if somebody had told me uh, all those numbers were going to come up when I first started this, I would have told them they're crazy. <laughs> well, I've got to get back to work here and finish this batch of M6s and list them in the store because I think I'm out right now. Uh, now, each one of these, as you saw me over there, I precision drill the holes in them. And then I bring them over here to a, <clears throat> a reamer, and I ream them uh, one thousandths over. And then I have a plug gauge that I check to make sure, because sometimes I have to go back in maybe three times. And I try to get a fit that's just uh, a fit where they'll just slide in uh, and just slide out without sticking, but with very little slot. Sometimes I'm more successful than others, uh, but that's what I shoot for. Now, if you've ever bought a prototype from me with legs in it, the, probably the fit was a little bit loose. That's because on the prototypes, I'm just trying to get everything in the right place, and I'm not, uh, I'm not concentrating on fit. I'm concentrating on just getting the basic design down pat. 
So unfortunately, if you've bought a prototype stove from me with legs, it's probably not a real great fit. So, But the finished product, once I get done and get everything figured out, uh, is uh, a much better fit. Well, uh, for this I've been using my uh, digital calipers. But i got to tell you, these digital calipers, uh, I'm not real impressed with them. I, I prefer the, the analog ones with the dial on because these digital ones, uh, for me, tend to wear out fairly fast. I can wear a set of these out in a month. Uh, they're not, not real high quality. I haven't, I haven't found any of these digital scales to work. I'm sure if you bought one from Star Red or something that was three or $400 it would be, but these, these uh, Chinese digital calipers are... Uh, what's the word? junk. <laughs> so uh, I've got a whole pile of boxes up there where I bought them. I can see three here. There's another one in the house. So I've gone through at least four of these this year. I don't buy them anymore. They're just uh, junk. My best calipers I've picked up, I've picked up from a machinist who had a yard sale. Uh, and those are pretty good calipers, but those are analog with a dial. So, uh, I think that's everything for today. My fire's gone out. I'm, I'm pretty near done for the day. It's uh, 3 o'clock. We just came back from the post office, and I forgot to take any pictures. Do we? Oh, well. I'll be going again tomorrow. I had uh, eight orders today. One of them going to Slovenia, whatever. <laughs> so, uh, I'm Tinny from Mini Bull Design. Get out and hike. Take a friend. Enjoy the great outdoors, and more important than anything, try to have a really great day, and try to take some time out to have a little bit of fun today. Your day will go a lot better. Bye-bye.